back moms. It's Alyssa Blaze from the Be Mom Strong Training Academy. All right, so today's strength session is going to be um, heavy involved in strength and less sort of conditioning. Um, so we're really gonna feel stronger after this workout. I'm gonna invite you to grab either your yoga tuna balls or a couple of tennis balls. You're gonna need a weight. You can also use you know, a jug of laundry. Um, the weight's going to wanna to be between about 25 and 35 pounds, depending on um, what you've got around. And then grab your, um, your band. Okay, and if you don't have a band, don't worry, you, don't, um, we, you can do it without the band for your workout today. Okay, so come on and join me. We're gonna actually come onto our back. We're gonna get those glutes fired up, wakened up before we get into this. So you're gonna take the balls right in behind your bum. Okay, so the, it's like you're putting the balls in your back pocket. Let the weight of your body just sink into the balls. Take a couple of breaths there. And then just start to move your hips from side to side. So you're feeling the hips skim over top of the balls from one side of the mat to the other. Okay, one side to the other. And then the balls are gonna to start to move just because um, you know, you've got your, your muscles of your butt on top of the balls. So they will start to move, you can put them back to center. But just send your hips to the left and let your right knee open to the right. Okay, so you're gonna feel that right ball start to push into the head of your thigh bone. And then move back to center, hips to the right, left knee opens to the side. So do that a couple of times, hips to the right, Left knee opens, hips to the left, right knee opens. By the way, we are going along the grain of your piriformis muscle, the muscle that's involved in external rotation. And it's the muscle that we want to be strong and activated in a lot of our leg strength exercises. Okay, so your hips are going to move to the left, your right knee open to the right, I want you to straighten your right leg out, if you're able, and maybe lift it in the air a couple of times. Three. Come into figure four. Take two breaths there. Then you're going to unwind, switch sides. So hips to the right, left knee opens to the side. Straighten your left leg, lift it in the air a couple of times. And then cross your left ankle above your right knee. Take a couple of breaths. Good, okay, come off those balls. Let's start to press ourselves up into our tabletop position. So you're gonna bring your hands under your shoulders, your knees underneath your hips, spread your fingers wide, come into that core breath, breathing really wide. Exhale, starting to engage the core muscles. Hug those muscles inwards. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Okay, I want you to take your left knee in the air. You're going to keep your knee bent to 90 degrees. You're going to take your left knee open to the side. And you're going to bring it down towards the floor. And then push it up again. So out to the side. Around, down, up. Around, down, and up. Around, down, and up. One more time. Then you're gonna step the left foot forwards in between your thumbs, find a little lunge here. Breathing in, breathing out. Okay, go ahead and sit onto your bum cheek. So your legs are 90 degrees angles. I want you to lean forwards towards the leg. Take a couple of breaths there, breathing in and out. Just getting the areas of our body warmed up before we get into some of our strength. So really try to lean the chest forwards instead of straight down to the floor. The spine is nice and long. All right, go ahead and press yourself back up into the tabletop position. Okay, hands under shoulders, knees underneath your hips. Take the right foot to the sky, around towards the front and down. So you're doing this up in the air, push the sole of your foot to the sky, take it around, keep it as high as you can and down. Up, around, down, up, around, down. 
Go ahead, step your right foot forwards in between your thumbs. Find your lunge, knee on top of your ankle. Breathing in, breathing out. Walk your hands up your thigh, take two breaths there. And then go ahead, bring your hands down, sit onto your bump. Find that 90 degree angles with your legs and lean forwards. So lean forwards towards your heel, keeping the spine really long. All right, go ahead and come up into standing position. So you're gonna take the strap, you're gonna bring the strap around your ankles. You're gonna have your feet start at hips distance and width apart, your knees are bent. You're gonna do 10 steps to the right. Okay, step away, step together. So try to keep tension on the band. Try to keep your knees pushing out wide to the side. You're gonna to start to feel that right in your butt, warming that butt up. So once you hit 10 on one direction, go ahead, come back the other way. And then go ahead, you're gonna bring the, the strap now, the band around your knees. You're gonna take your feet wide. Okay, toes can be slightly turned out. Hands can be across your chest or out in front. So inhale, I want you to sit your bum back. Knees are pushing wide into the band, exhale to stand. Inhale, pushing out, chest is tall, exhale to stand. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more time. And exhale. Go ahead. Put the band around your ankles. Come back into your side step. Okay, lateral step up to the side. So you're in this nice athletic position, chest is tall, keeping tension on the band, keeping your toes pointing forwards. So we're not leading with the toes, we're actually leading with the heel. And then over to the other side. Shuffle side step. For 10. And then go ahead and bring the band. Bring your band right around your knees. Okay, so your hips are gonna push back. Your chest is gonna stay upright. Inhale here, exhale to stand. Inhale down, exhale to stand. Inhale, exhale. Exhale, lift that pelvic floor, strengthen the core as you lift. And good, 10. Okay, and take this out. Just do a couple of leg swings. So you can hold on to a wall, the counter, or your chair. Do five forward swings. And then switch sides, five in the other direction. The body stays upright. All right, so we are ready. So I'm gonna grab my weight. I've got a kettlebell here. Again, you can also have your free weight. You can also have, um, you know, your laundry detergent soap, okay? So if you don't have any weights accessible nearby, toes can be turned out. Okay, so we're gonna come into our deadlift. We're actually gonna do five sets of this, okay? Each exercise is gonna be 10 reps. Here we go. So you're gonna push your hips back, keep your chest lifted, grab hold of the kettlebell, knees pressing wide, exhale, you're gonna pick up the weight and stand. Okay, inhale, drop your hips back, chest stays lifted, exhale, squeeze and stand. Exhale, 
exhale, squeeze that core tight. And 10. Switch over to the other side. Shoulder on top of your elbow. Legs can be straight or bent. Take an inhale. Exhale, lift, arm up. Reaching underneath. And extend and lift. the stool that you would use for your kids to brush their teeth at the counter, okay? If you want to, you can grab some free weights here. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to step your foot into the ground. You're using your butt. You're going to draw your knee up. Okay, inhale, you're going to step down. Exhale, squeeze your butt, lift the knee up. Okay, if you want to keep the chest open, have your hands interlace them behind your leg. Think of really powering up through that heel. Nine and ten. All right, let's switch sides. Okay, so there's a tendency to keep your weight shifting forwards. You want to stay back, you want to stay upright. Exhale to stand and lay knee, lift your knee. Inhale down, exhale. Push through the floor. So try not to use momentum with the bottom leg. What you're really doing is you're using the foot that's on the step or on the bench to push up. Okay, so you're not using the other leg as momentum, kicking yourself up. Okay, and 10, good. Come on over to a chair. You're gonna stretch your legs out in front. Okay. Hands on either side of the chair. Inhale, you're gonna lower down. Exhale, squeeze and lift. And push up. Little tricep dip here. Eight, nine, and ten. All right, go ahead. Come back to the beginning. So we're going to come into our deadlifts. I'm going to demo this one from the side. Second set, toes slightly turned out. Okay, remember, you're going to push your hips back. And then exhale, squeeze your butt to stand up. So inhale, hips back, chest lifted. Exhale, squeeze and stand. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Last one. Good. Drop down the weight. Come on over to your side plank. Forearm on the ground. Again, legs straight or knees bent. Take an inhale, exhale, brace your core, lift your hips up. Inhale down. Eight, nine, ten. If you're feeling really wobbly on those, even with your knees bent, just stick with the side plank and pause and hold, okay? Pause and hold for about 20 seconds. Forearm on the ground, legs are straight. Inhale here, exhale, lift up, arm up. Inhale. Nine and 10. All right, come on over to your step. Okay, so inhale down, exhale, step up. Inhale down, exhale, squeeze your butt, stand. So you can pause and hold at the top. Inhale, exhale, power up. Inhale at the bottom, exhale, stand. 
Inhale, exhale. Drive up. Drive up. Get that leg swinging up in the air. Eight, nine, and ten. All right, come on over for your tricep dips. Come on over to your chair. Walk your arms out. Okay, you're gonna bend the elbows. You're gonna push your arms straight. Bending down, pushing up. That's 10. All right, two sets done. Grab a sip of water if you need one. Working on our third set. Coming into our deadlifts. Okay, feet wide, toes turned out. Inhale, bum back, chest lifted, exhale, squeeze and stand. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. So deadlift really means you're starting from a dead position. So I want you to try to bring your weight all the way down to the ground. Okay, we're not just dropping down to here. If you feel like you can't bring it all the way down, drop it onto a block or a stack of books, okay? So bring the floor closer to you. But I want it all the way down, squeeze, stand all the way up. All right, come into your side plank. Rotations, legs straight, inhale. Exhale, we're gonna lift, arm up. Inhale down, exhale lift. And that's 10. Wrap around to the other side. Here we go. Inhale on the bottom. Exhale, lift. your bench dips, tricep dips, bend the elbows, push the arms straight, two, three, four, and ten, all right, I'm going to grab some water myself, so we're more than halfway done the workout, we got two more sets to go. You can do it. You might even be starting to break a sweat. I promise you, when this one's done, you're gonna feel good. And notice that we haven't done any sort of conditioning or cardio. Still getting that heart rate up. We're still working hard. Okay, here we go. Feet wide, toes turned out. Maybe a smile on your face. Hips back, chest lifted. Inhale, exhale, stand. Knees wide. Remember, we're pushing those knees out just like we did with the band. Drop that bum down. Nine. And ten. All right. Side plank. 
Inhale to prepare, exhale, lift up. Inhale here. Exhale, squeeze and lift. Inhale down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew. All right. Step ups. Okay, pushing down, exhale, squeeze your butt, lift the knee. Inhale down, exhale, lift. So really try to drop, push the hips back. And 10. Other side. Inhale here, exhale, lift. And 10. All right, here we go. Tricep dips. Walk your feet out, hands to the bench. Inhale, bend your elbows, exhale, up. So we're still using our core and our butt, squeezing our glutes, bracing our curl. Exhale to push up, remember. And that's 10. All right. So we got one more set. Take a minute. So we do our strength training. We take a little bit more space, maybe in between the, the sets, to grab some water. Um, because we don't want to be totally fatigued going into each, each set of each exercise, okay? Different than the hit. The hit is like a blast. You're, that's the focus. Keep that heart rate up the whole time, okay? So take breaks whenever you need to throughout this sequence. Here we go. Straddle that, that weight. All right, hips back, chest lifted, last set. Exhale, lift. And two. And three. And four. And five. And six. And seven. Eight. Nine. And 10. Good, drop the kettlebell down. Here we go. Come onto your side. Legs are straight or bent. Okay, take an inhale, exhale, lift. Rotating in, keep those hips in the air. Two. All right, switch sides. Straighten your body out. You're this long, beautiful line. Beautiful, breathing in, exhale, breathing out. Last one, 10. All right. Okay. Bench step ups. Okay. Inhale, exhale, squeeze and stand. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Power up, eight. So the faster you push. 
push up, the more of those fast twitch muscle fibers you're going to develop. Okay, to be more, a little bit more powerful in your moves. Exhale, stand. Knee up, two. Push down, three. It'll also help you get up those stairs a little bit easier. Carrying a load of groceries up a few flights of stairs. Nine and ten. All right. Last one. Come on over. Tricep dips. Okay, bending down. One, two, three. And ten. All right. Give yourself a pat on the back. We got a little bit more to do. We're gonna do some core work before we finish. Okay, so you're gonna stay with your chair. And um, we're gonna come into three different core exercises. The first one is going to be, we're just on an incline. So I'm using the chair. I'm gonna walk my body out, okay? You could also do this pushing your hands against the wall. The most challenging is your feet on your hands on the ground. So exhale, you're gonna take your right knee you're gonna bring it across your body to the left. Okay, inhale down, exhale, right knee to left. We're gonna go for eight on one side. And eight, then your left foot is gonna lift in the air. Exhale, knee to cross to the right. Seven. And eight. All right, come on over. So this next one is a lateral flexion, okay? You could do this without any weight. You'll even start to feel this inside your body, okay? If you've got a free weight, grab your free weight or your kettlebell. I've only got one here, so I'm a little bit, I'm gonna be working hard. We're going for eight, okay? So you're gonna stand up tall, grab your weight. The other hand comes behind your head. Okay, so I'll just demo here, here we go. Okay, so you're gonna lean down, flex down, exhale, stand. Try to keep the chest lifted. You're using your core to lift. Last one for me. All right, switching sides. Hand up, inhale down. You're really using that core breath here. Holding yourself up. Seven, and that's eight for me. All right, come on down, come onto your belly, okay? So you're gonna bring your hands, they can come straight out in front, forehead on the ground, legs are extended. Okay, so what I want you to do is we're gonna lift opposite arm, opposite leg in the air. So inhale here at the bottom, exhale, you're gonna lift right arm and left leg. Inhale on the bottom, exhale, lift left arm and right leg. Eight aside. Keep your hip bones pushing down, okay? Keep your hip bones pushing down, keep your tailbone pushing away from your back. So you're not overly arching your back, keeping that core strong. Bracing that core to lift. Last one for me on either side. All right, shake it out and through the hips. Hands under the forehead, making your way back up. Okay, so we're gonna come into the plank cross body knee drive. I'm gonna come into a plank on my chair. Inhale here, exhale, knee to opposite elbow. See if you can touch your knee to your elbow. Touch and hold it there. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. Done. All right. Come into your lateral flexion, okay? So grab your weight. Stand up tall. Hand behind your head. Inhale down. Exhale, lift. 
So try not to let the chest collapse. We're keeping everything open through the upper body. Eight for me. Switching sides. Good job. Okay, last one. On your belly. Arms out. Legs out. Okay, so if you want to, instead of lifting opposite arm, opposite leg, you can lift both in the air. Okay, so both arms and both legs. Or just arms and or just legs, okay? So let's switch it up here. Let's try lifting all four together. Inhale at the bottom. Exhale, lift. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right. Press yourself up to your knees. All right, so we've got one more, one more of these beautiful core sets to strengthen your core set. I'll have to remember that one. All right, here we go. Back up into your plank knee drops. Opposite arms. One. Sixteen for me. Okay, so grab your weight. Stand up nice and tall. Gonna do that lateral flexion. Feet are hips distance and width apart. Exhale to stand. Other side. Here we go. And eight. All right, that one is done. Come on to your belly. Last set. Super woman. Here we go, arms up. Okay, so we're always trying to move with the breath, okay? So here we go. Inhale here. Exhale, lift. And down. Shake your butt. Even windshield wiper your legs from side to side. So press your hands up, press back into a child's pose. Knees wide, toes together, hips sink back and down. And as you just like slowly start to calm your body down, just take a moment to thank your beautiful body for everything it's done, for all of the hard work, for being kind to yourself. And know that you can do and ask more of you. Breathing into your back. All right, pressing yourself up. You can take your legs, stretch them out in front. We'll do a little, a little hamstring stretch. Inhale up, exhale, reach forwards. Grab for whatever you can reach. Knees, shins, toes, feet. Calming your body down. By the way, great effort on the workout today. Five sets. It's not easy. It's not easy both physically and both mentally. So, 
Great job, mom. Legs at wide. Reach your hips forwards. And lift up. All right, good stuff. Have an awesome day and a good segue to finishing this off if you want to do a little bit more stretching would be the Happy Hips video. You can find that in the recovery section. Have yourself an amazing day, ladies. Namaste.